I was trying to film last night, but um, the phone kept running out of storage, and I would delete stuff, and it kept running out of storage, so I couldn't finish. So I went and worked in the storage unit for a few hours or something, listening to podcasts uh, on um, recovery, and um, then I just slept in a Walmart parking lot. And um, it stormed like crazy all night. And Walmart plays stuff over the uh, speakers out here, I think, to probably distract people because there's like some RVs and stuff that have been here for as long as I can remember. Um, but uh, you couldn't hear the, the speakers and stuff because it just blew and the van just rocked. And, and it was actually, it was okay for me, but it was very stormy. And um, so now I'm waking up and it's very cold. I'm trying to get the windshield clear enough to drive up to McDonald's and get a coffee and then park somewhere else um, to just uh, figure out how I'm going to utilize today what my game plan is because I'm a little bit torn. Uh, it's heavily affected by how low my batteries are uh, in the van and I need to plug in somewhere to recharge them so I've got to figure out the day so yeah so I'm using um, my camera my little Sony point and shoot that I've had for a long 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 time but it's just this great little camera and it never lets me down and so um, I'm going to use that because I don't have to worry about it running out of storage. Oh yeah, and another thing. Um, so last night when I was at the storage unit and I tried to put something in the back door of the van, I went to open the door and I couldn't open it because the garbage wood that I used on the side of my storage box on the backs is now, because it, it's like I sealed the wood to some degree with um, with paint but this light wood that I used on the side of the box not for structure but just for covering it, um, it completely absorbed all the moisture and it looks like um, a bad storm on the ocean now it's just all wavy and one side um, waved out so far that it's interfering with the opening of the rear door and so I have to, in real short term, um, cut new panels somewhere, somehow, uh, and then coat them uh, with wood, uh, or with paint. To, that's what I, how I was trying to seal them. It makes me wonder. Actually, that wood might have got, got chipped up a little bit. Anyway, it just looks like an, a bad accordion. Um, so. Yeah, I have to replace the panels on both sides of the storage box. ASAP. Alright, so the uh, back wood on the carry cabinet that I built on the back door, um, that was so um, warped, the wood absorbed the moisture and warped so bad I couldn't open the back door. So I was trying to think my way through, okay, where can I get a saw, where can I... Uh, where can I work, you know, what can I get away with, la la la, try and get these panels replaced. Because um, they are just warping, like they're just going to pop right off the, the cabinet. And um, so I was talking to a guy I know and trying to work out something, it was getting complicated. And I realized, you know what, you can buy half sheets of wood at Home Depot and they do cuts for free. I was in there recently to try and get the wood for the top cabinet, which of course never, or the top um, case for the roof, never got built um, before everything went nasty. Um, but anyway, so I went to, so I went into Home Depot and I walked up to the back where the saw was and the guys there cutting a piece of wood. Now the corner of my eye, I seen the customer that this guy was cutting for start coming towards me and I, I looked over and I realized oh 
it's Osevilius from Mir. And um, anyway, so we had a nice long chat about music, stuff like that. And uh, so that was really great. Like, I would never have that happen to me before because I was just always hiding in a basement in the country, fearing what I could possibly do wrong that would invoke outrage. And uh, it was, anyway, so it was so nice to see um, Asif and, and be able to talk and, and we're gonna, we've made plans that we're going to hopefully get together and talk to, together soon and um, maybe do something more interesting. And uh, so I got my wood and it's a holiday, the traffic is insane, but I got over to my buddy's place and he let me um, do some stuff in his garage. So, so Home Depot cut the wood, I grabbed my little sander from the storage unit and some paint and um, and my batteries were dead 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 actually when I got here there was a little bit of power and I, and I plugged a sander into it while I was waiting for him to come and I did a little bit of sanding and then it died so it's just everything is at zero plugged in for a while and not showing any any uh, charge yet which is never a, a great thought but it shows 420 watts going in so hopefully by morning everything will be just great everything will be like sunshine and daisies okay so what's going on okay so so do you think the wood warped a little bit and is coming off the cabinet. Now the rest of the cabinet was built out of good material, but obviously I picked a bad piece of some sort of a veneer for for this. So I have two new panels cut, uh, ten and an eighth by thirty-five inches long. Ten and an eighth by thirty-five inches long, and then I sanded the edges a little bit. Now I'm putting paint on them. I'm slowly getting paint on the two new panels to try and seal them up. Isn't that groovy? So this all happening just today. Just happened today. Thought it was going to take like a week to get this done. And uh, we are ripping through it. I, I have some really great friends. Alright, stayed up till 3 a.m. Tinkering around, cleaning up the garage as a thank you. And we have one panel. Oh, ha, ha, ha. One panel is installed. Now I gotta pull all this hardware out and install the second panel. Got the old broken panel off. I just gotta get this stuff off. And second panel installed. Those reflections make it look like there's waves in it, but no, she's a solid piece of plywood. Hopefully it'll stay that way. Had to put a screw or two in here. This was lifting off. I think this was only glued. I think those strips might only be glued. Might have to put in one there too. I did the air pressure. Check the oil and spray next all the front windows and clean the inside of the windows. Are you beaten, broken, destroyed, got nothing left? You've given up and you feel like checking out? Don't. Start thinking outside the cage.
across the sky. 